Hi everyone, you're watching a Bubble Up Casting Solution from computer to TV. Here we're clicking on a Meta Cafe video, opening the stream in Bubble Up NP using the, our Chromecast. Video is starting to play. It's going to cast to the bigger TV in a second. Okay, there it is now, casting on the big TV. Okay, this is a how-to video on casting XBMC from computer to TV using Bubble Up NP. No smartphone is necessary with this setup, but there are quite a few programs you're going to need. Okay, the first one you're going to need to download is the Bubble Up NP server. There's the address. Click Windows Installer. We're going to start, it's starting to download, but since I already have the program, we're going to stop it. And uh, we're, we're going to show you the settings that I uh, had to change. So start up Bubble Up uh, Server. There's some of the IP address, the HTTP port address. So go into Network and Security. I changed uh, from default, I had to change to local host. That's my public host name. I put in some passwords, checked off these three boxes, and that's all I did here on the server end of it. Now, you need to set up a port 58050. Here's my port. Uh, it's my local address followed by the 58050. So you need to set that up in your router. That's very important, or it won't work. Next we need a program called Blue Stacks. You have to download the app player. And uh it's a pretty big download, so I'm not gonna download it right now since I've already done it. Another thing you need is the uh XBMC Android program. You need the XAF custom build for non neon touchscreen devices. So download and install that and then Click the APK on your desktop after it downloads. That's where I downloaded it to. You install it, and it goes right into Blue Stacks right from your desktop. Okay. Next thing we need to do is search for Bubble Up NP. So put in that in Search Apps. Search Play for Bubble Up NP. And there's two versions. One is a free version, one's a paid version. The free version, you only get 20 minutes of transcoding at a time. So if you like it, you should get the uh, full version. I've already installed it, so you'd have an install button right here. And so install that, and uh, let's see how it works. We're going to fool around with a few settings. Go into your settings button here. Click settings. Then hit Networks and Settings. Click where it says Unset here. That's where you're going to put your server address. Mine is 192.168.110, followed by the port that you set up earlier on your router, 58050. So uh, hit the Test button. If it works, you'll see Connection Successful. Then hit Apply. Okay, there's a few more settings I fooled around with. I think this is only for music, but I fooled around with it. 320, I put it on. Same thing for Wi-Fi, the maximum. Then uh, these are more important. These are for video transcoding. Mobile transcoding, I put 720. Wi-Fi transcoding, I did the same thing. That's the max, I suppose. So uh, the next thing we need to do is go into Chromecast settings and make sure this is working right you'll see transcoding support yes yes enable should be checked okay now we uh, want to go into our render make sure it's set on Chromecast it is 
and go into our devices. Yeah, there's Chromecast as the render. For libraries, I put it on local media server. Okay, the next thing we need to search for, we need to download a file manager. Type in file manager, hit search, play for file manager. And that's the one I chose. Number two, file manager. I installed this. And you'll have to do the same. This involves the player core factory file for external players that we're going to need. We're need going to need to put it in a specific directory. So I'm going to show you how to do that. That's the address where the uh, modified player core factory for bubble up NP is. I'm going to provide you with all these addresses in the description. So you would download that, hit the gray download button, then you would hit the green download button. And this is uh, the directory I'm going to show you next where it should go. Hit program data in your C drive and blue stacks user data shared folder and uh, I guess I never download it. I'll have to go get it from a different location. Yeah, I put it in my downloads file by mistake. So I'm going to cut and paste it out of here. I'm going to go back into where I was earlier. We'll get to see it a second time. User data, shared folder. Now paste it in here. That's the path. Okay, now we're going to go back into Blue Stacks in the File Manager next. Okay, there it is. And we have to uh, cut and paste it. This is where we put it on our hard drive. BST Shared Folder, there it is. Player Core Factory, XML for Bubble Up. So hit, uh, we're going to move it now. Hit Move. Home. Go into Android, data, org.xbmc.xbmc, files. Okay, I went too far. I'm going to have to back up here. Okay, after files is .xbmc. Then user data. And I already actually have the file in here but you would overwrite your current file like this, hit overwrite. Okay, so let's go into XBMC and show you how this works. Hit videos, add-ons. I'm going to go into Meta Cafe. Try travel and outdoors. try this video travel guide to Florida so we open the stream here it is in bubble up MP NP there's Chromecast you see video starting to play now one two three four and it, it's going to cast automatically to your big TV if your Chromecast is running and there it is so good luck with this and I hope it works out for you take care